This video tells the story of the Haber process, an industrial process which turns nitrogen and hydrogen gases into ammonia to be used for fertilizer. The discovery of this process has saved billions of lives. In order to tell this story, we first need to learn a little about plants and the nitrogen cycle. Nitrogen is essential for life. It is a component of amino acids, the building blocks of proteins, and the basis of RNA and DNA. As plants grow, soil is depleted of nitrogen. Although the Earth's atmosphere is 78% nitrogen, N2, plants cannot use it in this form. Instead, the nitrogen must react to form other compounds that plants can use, a process called nitrogen fixation. Some bacteria and archaea in soil, called diazotrophs, can fix nitrogen, but it is not enough to feed the plants we need for survival. This is why we use fertilizer. In the early 20th century, fixed nitrogen was mined in the form of nitrate mineral deposits found in the Atacama Desert in South America. These mineral deposits are extremely rare, and this source was dwindling. Unless another source of fixed nitrogen could be found or invented, the world was at risk for a global famine. The problem with nitrogen fixation is because of the stability of the nitrogen molecule in the air. N2 has three bonds holding it together, a triple bond. This is the strongest type of chemical bond and takes enormous amounts of energy to break it apart. At ordinary pressures, the temperature required would be over 1,000 degrees Celsius. In nature, the only thing hot enough is a bolt of lightning. At the same time, the ammonia that is the product of the nitrogen fixation reaction is fragile and would be destroyed if the temperature is required to make it. Here's where Fritz Haber comes in. Fritz Haber was a chemist born in 1868 in Prussia. In 1909, Haber invented the Haber process, also known as the Haber-Bosch process, with industrial scientist Carl Bosch. To reduce the temperature required, Haber figured out that he could increase the pressure and use a catalyst to speed up the reaction. The reaction combines nitrogen gas from the air, N2, and hydrogen gas, H2, to form ammonia, NH3, which can be used by plants and animals. He invented the process in a lab and then worked with Bosch to expand it for industrial processes. The Haber process is still used today to fix nitrogen. In fact, it is estimated that of all the nitrogen in your body, at least half was fixed through the Haber process. 